Hey guys, what is up? It's Charlie, and in today's video, we're going to be doing a review slash tutorial on my favorite iOS app ever called Action Movie FX. Now, I used to do my tutorials by filming from my dad's phone and, like, actually doing them on the iPad, but I just got a new iPod Touch 4th generation, like, yes seriously yesterday we got it used so now i'm actually using the ipad to film and i'm gonna try using the ipod touch so when we're gonna be doing it on action movie fx so the app is actually free when you get it it's like a visual effects editor and but like you like some effects are free when you get it but some have to be purchase through in-app purchasing so once you get the app you're just gonna press go and then you have a bunch of different all effects here now when you actually get the app you actually you only have three effects or well, not well you have more than three effects but you have car smash demolition rock missile attack avalanche and if we go way over we have the spider strike now now I'm like like as you see we have like all of these call of duty black ops effects right here those those can be downloaded as a pack for free and then you'll know and then this rough terrainian or ter terrain I don't know how you pronounce it rough terrainian effect right here that's a free download too and so are these, um, let me see, let me find them, all these Star Trek effects. Like Star Trek Into Darkness, those. Except for ones like, you know, these ones are Star Trek too. But, that, but those I had to purchase. So anyway, now about how to use it. So you're just going to choose the effect that you want. Right now I'll be doing, um, the Iceman, because I really like him. And then when you get it, you'll get some tips about how to do it. Then you're going to hit start, and then you'll get this target in the middle. That's, like, where the effect is going to happen. And then you have the record button right here, and you have record for five seconds. So let me do this here. I don't know if you can see this or not, but if you can, that's good. So once the bars start blinking green, then you're good. And then you can kind of, you, you like edit the timing with this little timeline right here. You edit the timing where you want it to happen, and you can actually move the effect around. And then once you think you got it right, you click OK. But if you want to redo your scene, then you can just go back to the camera right here. So, if you hit OK, it'll process the movie. I guess the only thing I really don't like about this app is that you can't use pre-recorded footage. But, you know, that's really a small p price to pay. So, once you got the, your effect ready, you can watch it. I think it's it's pretty cool. Yeah, and it'll tell you to rate the app. No way. And then and then you can make a new movie by pressing this button. You can just trash it and you can actually share it. So when you hit share, you can share it to Facebook. You can email the clip to somebody or you can save it to camera roll, which is really cool. So then you can put it in iMovie and then make your own movies. But I'm just going to throw it away because it's just really nothing so, yeah, guys, that's pretty much the tutorial for Action Movie FX. See you guys.